in and enjoy some great memories of the 20th annual MSBL World Series. And certainly congratulations to Steve Sigler and Sigler and his uh, tremendous staff, uh, Tom Pendergrass and, and Clyde Miller. Walton's next delivery swung on and fouled at the plate. This is Pat Cook, I believe. And he chops one over the pitcher's mound. The shortstop coming in, off balance throw. Yes, indeed, he got it. A fabulous play out there for the first out of the inning. Nice job by Byron Tate. He's been solid at shortstop all night long. Now the batter is Art Kruger. And Kruger takes a strike. Actually, that was Kruger. This is Mike Fiorenzo. Popped him up. That's out of play. Actually, I think they batted out of order. I think that was Pat Cook. Kruger may be out of the ball game. Fiorenzo is a starting pitcher. He pitched the first four innings, gave up eight runs. Tate, another opportunity, and he got him at first base. Two outstanding plays. And the Canadians are one out away from a victory, and here's Zeke Padron. And a check swing foul. This is a big win for Comox because now they will go to two and three, and they got a chance to make this year's tournament respectable with one game left to go in round robin play. That one just outside, one and one on Zeke. Padron, the starting catcher for the Michigan Rit Music Ball Club. Again, thanks to Steve Walton. And we certainly hope to see you guys next year. That one just off the outside corner. Now, this umpire's called that pitch several times here tonight, but he did not there. And here's the next one, and it's popped up, but it is not playable. And now it is down to a two-ball, two-strike count with two outs. We are in the final inning of play. This is it. Walton one strike away from wrapping up the victory and qualifying for a save. And a swing and a miss, and down he goes. The ball gets away from the catcher. He'll throw it to first, and the Comox Harvest Marine Canadians have done it here from Tempe Diablo Stadium. A very impressive 19-9 victory. They came up with the clutch hitting when they needed it, and it was the clutch pitching of Steve Walton who picks up the save in relief of the winner, Randy Enns. This has been a presentation of APN Sports, Arizona's leader in amateur sports coverage. So for our entire crew, I'm Jeff Lowry. Thanks for being with us. And hopefully, until next year, so long, everybody.